Uh, apparently some of my teammates are getting kicked out. Uh, the owner hasn't paid for their hotel room, so they're getting kicked out. We haven't heard anything yet. This morning, he said he called him the, this morning. He said he's gonna pay, and then later we got the news from the dad that they haven't paid yet at all. And then he tried calling Alvaro again, but he's not answering the phone. Now. That's wild, bro. I mean, if he's not paying for the hotel, I'm pretty sure he's not gonna pay us either. True, because they haven't they haven't paid for any of the hotel yet. And so now they're kicking us out of the hotel. They're kicking you out as well? Me, Jamal, Camillo, JJ and all of them. Apparently they haven't paid. What? No, you guys don't. Like, we're just hanging out. Yeah. Um, we're not, like, doing anything. At least you have a place to be. Yeah, I appreciate it. Uh, Damn. Yeah. So, I figured more things out and I'll talk to you soon. Yeah, let me know. If you, if you, if you guys need a place to come, just come over. Alright, thank you. That's crazy. So we're literally about to get kicked out of this hotel. And this dude wants to do voice vocal practice. <laughs> you can <need> tell. <laughs> Time to pack. Because we're getting kicked out. Yeah. Oh. And me are not like the one who are re eh, responsible. Responsible oh, of that. I know. Eh, yeah. It's uh, my father, but with the coach and my father, they are trying like, to solve the problem. Okay. So we are going to like the apartment of coach. Eh, only you are the ones of the hotel. So okay. we need to pack up and move. Okay. You friend going to to Mitchell apartment? Yeah, I'm gonna go to Mitchell's apartment. Okay. In the issue. Eh, can you send us our the direction? Yeah. 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 So. The reason I'm not really packing is <laughs> you're out, I'm in. <laughs> Camden's actually taking my spot. Yeah, Columbia takeover. Almost done packing. Goodbye, hotel. It's crazy. It feels like a movie, man. Just getting kicked out of the hotel. Rock bottom again. Hey! And then all of a sudden we become a championship team and out of nowhere we fight through the adversity. That's all I'm hoping for, right? I need a place to sleep first. <laughs> all packed up. Sheesh! For us getting kicked out of our hotel. Um. Papa, where are we going? A lot of. I don't know, son. I don't know. Hey, ready for the next adventure? It's all gonna, it's all gonna go exactly as it should. So let's just have a good time while we're, while we're doing it. Amen to that. Amen to that. Oh, at least they got our food. Where? Okay. What do you think? It's a bullshit, man. 
Bullshit. So far, he says it's people. He says hotel people's fault. I don't even believe it or not, but like, that's the only thing we can do about it. So like, y'all still in the hotel. Everybody's still in the hotel on you. Yeah, everyone's still in the hotel right now. We're about to leave. Um, I think they're all gonna go to Coach's house. I'm probably just gonna go swimming with the Metros because I don't, I don't want like it's a lot of people in one place. Yeah, man, I'm sorry for that, bro. I'm, it's good, that's man. That's something I can't control, bro. I'm nah, sorry about don't that. Don't be sorry, bro. It's not your fault at all. That's don't, that, yeah, that's bro. Bullshit. Yeah, bro. Don't be sorry, bro. It's not your fault at all. Dude, Jay, how do you feel about getting kicked out of the hotel? They don't kick me. They kick you. <laughs> <laughs> that's <is> racist. <laughs> Being our rescue and savior, this man Same always comes in clutch. <laughs> you know the lovely place of him. You know he's living lavish out here <laughs> compared to us out here. <laughs> you, don't out, yeah. <laughs> you don't get kicked out. You don't get kicked out. And say hello to his mother. Hi. Say hello to everyone. <laughs> but thank you, man. I really hey, do appreciate life it. Life lesson: When your teammates get kicked out of their hotel, take them in. Be a good take teammate. Be a good right. teammate. Exactly. All right, another game day. At Mitchell's place. Mitchell's is a nice place. Oh. I don't know what's going on at the hotel yet. Um, we're still trying to figure that out. Uh, all I know is I gotta play a game today. That's all it is. You know, I can't deal with some things. You know, some things happen, and all I gotta do is just go out and play. Uh, all right, what up, my boy? You ready for game day? Ready for game day? Probably about, about to sleep today. We don't care because it's game day. That's true. We don't know where we're sleeping today. <laughs> The practice ratio is looking a little, it's looking rough. We've got to figure it out. We'll figure it out. So today's game two against the same team. No, I don't know. We're looking to open up a little faster pace and come out stronger. Last game they just killed us right off, the, right out of the gate. And we didn't, we didn't do anything for that. Um, disappointed in ourselves, but you know this is where we got to change it right now. Mitchell, how are you feeling today? Man? I feel good. I'm, uh, I'm excited. As people might find out, I'm into the psychology of it, and uh, it's different than playing for like a college. Like at college, we're paying to be there. Like you want to be there. That was a little reverse. It's the first time like we're getting paid to play. And also like you're looking out for your career afterwards. So like something like yesterday, like a pretty real snippet was like I was thinking about scoring. And like, now I gotta try and adjust and like just be, be grateful to be there in the moment and then like, the playing will take care of itself, so. Thinking about how we were back then, you know, in middle school, yeah. and us looking at ourselves and knowing where we'd be right now, yeah. we would think we're the coolest person in the world. You know, the fact that we're literally in Columbia playing professional yeah. basketball. Like, I, I just know that fourth grade cool. me is like, whoa. Smiling. You know, yeah, at, yeah. at the moment, we're like, dang, we're stressed about the games and everything. But, you know, back then, we're like, dude, it wasn't life. Right.
All right, so we just got an Uber. Um, another stressful game. It's been tough. It's a battle. Um, we're just not being really put in the positions that we need to, to make a play. And then um, just no chemistry on the team. No one knows the role right now. It's frustrating. Uh, so right now we're going to Mitchell's house because the hotel kicked us out and I don't know, I don't know what it is, but it's just the hotel's not letting us in. Apparently they say that they didn't pay, um, but our own, the owner is saying they paid. So it was miscommunication to that. And so we can't stay there tonight. Um, it's kind of ridiculous, but it is what it is, you know? <laughs> it's the journey of overseas, y'all. Like this is what sometimes you go through and you know, it's hard mentally sometimes, but you know, at the end of the day, I get to play basketball again, you know? He is not having it. I'm having a great time. Hello, Chase. Not Chase. Hello. Welcome. Welcome home. <laughs> yeah. What do you think about your, your analysis on the game today? Frustrating. Yeah. Uh, there's a saying, frustration is earned. And I don't think we've necessarily practiced the team, practiced the unit to earn the frustration yet. Like we have two guys that played 25 minutes who joined the team two days ago. They denied us the ball, pressured you the whole time. You gave it up. They didn't help off of us. And yeah. you know, we don't know how to work together as a unit to get our scorers open and to get the ball in the hands of people that make plays. So. They took our um, food to the hotel, but no one's staying at the hotel, so um, I just went to Mitchell's and just ordered some food, so God may do what you have, you know? Dude, nice little post-game meal. Holy crap, dude. This dude got a salad. I'm like, that <laughs> this humongous thing. So I just had the worst smoothie in my life, I feel like. I dare you to try it. Is it that bad? It's that bad. Looks good. I know, it looks delicious. <laughs> <laughs> oh.